another episode of Super Action Bros. I'm Chris. I'm Christopher. And on today's episode, we have something that came out of nowhere. Okay, let's let's be let's get a little behind the scenes. Now, normally when we do these videos, we list them off, you know, numberly, you know, just to I'll get tell them everything. But okay. But to put it as bluntly, we make sure that we do like the ones that are gonna get the most views, essentially first, and then we still get into other ones. That are hopefully doing gonna do amazing as well and do great. Mm -hmm. You do if you want me to only do this. I want to no, do go this. Go ahead. Okay. So, anyways, we're gonna start our recordings as of you know as of our usual days with you know Tomb Raider. But we're going somewhere different. This we're, one again. Back to what I was trying to say. Um, was this one came out of nowhere. We thought it was something from, was it, College Humor. That's what we thought. That's what, well, at least that's what I thought, pretty much. I thought it was just one big joke or, you know, or even like, like you had posted up pretty much going, this is no April Fool's joke, you know, <laughs> type of thing. This is yeah. actually the real deal. Or, of course, talking about, uh, let me get the full name because the teaser trailer we have doesn't give the full name, called Dundee. The son of a legend returns home. Yes. Now, this is a Crocodile Dundee movie in 2018. Okay, so where should we start? Um, Who's playing his son? Well, yeah, Danny McBride, but I'm fine with that. I'm fine. No, no, I'm just saying. I'm, I'm, I'm not, no, I'm not saying I'm like upset with that or anything like that. I'm just, I'm just saying pretty much who they got to play his son. That's all. I'm just saying... I, you know, I trust in his acting. I tr trust in his acting chops, stuff like that. It's just who they got. So, yeah. So they got Danny McBride to repri uh, not reprise role, but play his son. Mm -hmm. Now, question. Is, now question. In the original movies, though, did do we ever hear his son talk? Did he have Australian He was in. Accents? Um. Uh. He was in Cargill, and he goes to Los Angeles. Yeah. Now, did he son, was. He was in the movie. Now, did his son pretty much have an American accent, or did he have an Australian accent? I honestly don't remember. It's been like for it has been what feels what feels like forever since I've seen the the Los Angeles uh, movie, but they um he it is Damon Bright playing his son. Paul Hogan is reprising his role as the original Crocodile Dundee. Yeah, and I guess what they're by the title of it, I guess. His son returns to Australia, pretty much, to so it meet like, up with his dad again. So it sounds like he does. He's gonna. He's gonna have the, the American accent. Cause I don't remember from the original movie. I don't remember if he had the American or the the uh, Australian, you know, accent. Yeah. But it sounds like he, you know, he's been in the states for a while. Now he's coming over to visit his dad. So something like that. So um, I enjoyed the first one. Oh, the first one. Enjoyed, phenomenal. The first one's still a classic. Um, the second <laughs> one. That's, I, not, that's not a knife. This is a knife. Well, that's not a knife. This is a knife. Yeah, that's not a knife. This is a knife. How do you even get that there? I just... Well, yeah. uh, but sorry. Uh, the second one was good. It was it was a nice change from the first one where now it was it was her experiencing what he usually goes through on a daily basis. In Australia, the, yeah. In Australia on the second one. More or less because there's, there's bad guys and stuff like oh, that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the third one's not really good. Um, their one, one, they're, they're their one, one is just because they, they, they could do it. It feels like just because they could do it. It's because the second one did pretty decently well. They're like, oh, we could do it. We'll yeah, he was in New York. Let's take him to Los Angeles. Now. Yeah, so, but this one, like I said, let's just get this over with. It's a quick teaser. I, I, I don't I don't want to, like, tread on this maybe possibly being bad. I want to give it hope. Like, well, let's just take a look at this for the, uh, the, the teaser, the official teaser trailer for, what was it, Dundee? The Son of a Legend Returns Home. Yes, so here we go. It's a summer movie. Sorry. I lost you. I lost you. He's gonna have an Australian accent. You know he's gonna have an Australian accent. Wait. Good day, losers. No. Uh, losers. <laughs> Good day, loser. That's not a knife. That's a knife. Look at that. Look at me. Look at the knife. Okay, so... I... So, was that just Dane McBride saying he's in the movie, or is that Dane McBride's character in the movie? That part, I don't know. I... Was... That Dane... So, 
Was that was Danny McBride? That sounds like more like straight up just Danny McBride showing, that, hey, no, I'm playing this no. character. That sounds like his character from Eastbound and Down wearing a Crocodile Dundee outfit. Yeah, that's. I something. think this was. I think this was more I'm just announced. I'm hoping to God that is not his character. I am. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm hoping to God that is not his character. I'm hoping this was something like the Bright Two teaser we saw. It was more of a, just an announcement teaser. I'm, ho I'm hoping that's what this was. I hope, I'm really hoping that this was just more him, you know, having fun, going, you know, hey, I'm this character. This is what we're working on. And it's coming out. Yeah, because you know? because I'm not I'm not feeling it from that scene. I am not. I, I'm feeling more East Step Out and Down. I'm feeling more just Danny McBride having fun in this one little. No, scene. Danny McBride. No, no. It's the best way. Remember how people put it, it's Ben Stiller as Ben Stiller? It's yeah, it's Danny, Danny McBride as Danny, Danny McBride. McBride. That's what this is. Um, I wouldn't mind seeing people's reaction to this and like the theaters. They're going for those who know it. They'd be like, "Wait, what? Is this a is this a is this a prank? Is this a joke or something?" Supposed We're gonna to have to wait till to like a month or two for now to get a full trailer. Cause... Until we get a full trailer, right now I think they're just showing. They're saying that hey. This is what we're working on, and this is who's playing them, you know? Hey, so. like, uh, Dame Briary said he, um, really enjoyed, like, he was really psyched about this, because he, it's one, it was one of his favorite movies, pretty mm -hmm. much. So it's one of his favorite, it, um, So hopefully movies. he does it, I'm really hoping that, you know, if it is one of his favorite movies, hopefully he does a good job at it, at least. You know, he keeps, he keeps the spirit of what made the first one so great, you know? Mm -hmm. So, um, like I said, hopefully that, that... I think we need another trailer, is what you're uh, saying. Yeah, yeah, we need, we need another trailer. That's what it is, because this one, again, is just... This one's just like he's showing Danny McBride being Danny McBride, but he's just like I said, he's just announcing his character pretty much in a way. You know, he's this is the first time where he's like he get to say these lines and he's on the big screen. That's why. Right. I guess I think it's just an announcement. I'm hoping that God, that's just not it's just not Danny McBride as Danny McBride playing Crocodile Dundee's son. Yeah, I'm kind of hoping that. Um, we we're wanting more. That's pretty much overall. I think we want more from it just for now. I mean, it's really cool. It's exciting. But hopefully we get more, pretty much of you know of who his character is really gonna be like. Because I really don't hope it's. I'll to be honest. No offense to Danny McBride, I just hope it's not like this, pretty much. I really don't. I There's, really don't. I really. I mean, he, if he is a true fan or if he was a fan of the movie, hopefully he does it right. Well, I think what made the first one so great was was his his sheer oh um what's that term where you're somewhere. You're a man out, a kind of the man, man out of his element. Yeah, it was man, one of those man, first yeah. movies I saw growing up where it was one of those man out moments, and it worked so well because it was Paul Hogan playing the role. Yeah, and because you felt like, like he was literally because he wasn't really a big, big known star at that time. Yeah. you know, you bring this actor in, and it's like it, it's it, it's that it's that double meaning where this you know this little fish in a big pond, pretty much everything, you know, where it's just. In, it's not only he's being stuck into this world where, in like in New York or it's something like that, but it's also movie wise where it's like he's being stuck in this huge ass movie, and it's like we don't really we never really he heard fit, of him. And he fit the role very well. He, he fit it perfectly well. Yeah, but here I'm just like I'm not really feeling it. Well, of course, and again, it's just a teaser, and, and we're guessing, or we're hoping and guessing that it's just him announcing that he's in the movie. That's it. So hopefully, in the next trailer we get, it's something of. Uh, uh, maybe an, even if it's another teaser, but a teaser of the actual the actual film film of itself. If not the first official trailer, at least yeah. of what's going on. Yeah, so that's what I'm hoping. Yeah, for same the most here. Part. Uh, honestly, I need another trailer to really like get more into it. If I need, if I want to be. Yeah, exactly. So other than that, if you're new to the channel, you can hit the like button. If you want to talk some more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share this around, share it around. And if you like it just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to talking about Dundee, hit the subscribe button down below. And if you're also on mobile, hit that bell icon. Just let us know what you guys thought of this quick tease. Um, are you thinking pretty much just a, like more of like a character announcement uh, trailer? You know, mm -hmm. like we think, you know, just him just announcing, hey, I'm playing this character. And he's just, you know, revitalizing some of the actual pretty much famous lines that he's he said pretty much in the past films. Um, but just let us know in the comments below. Also put down what you thought of our reaction. But most of all, thank you for watching. So until next time, I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And this has been a very Dundee-filled episode of SRP. See you later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Yeah, and if you want to see any more of our videos, check out the playlist links down below in the description. And you can also check out our Twitter uh, account pretty much uh, down below at Super React Bros.